Hey guys, my name is Doriar. What's up? And today we're gonna talk about a bunch of stuff. The first one is my new partnership with MGN Sports. If you didn't know by now, and if you don't follow me on Twitter, again, like I really, I really like believe that if you follow me here, you should follow me there. Um, I have partnered with MGM Sports. I've announced it over there on my Twitter and I did a video with them already and uh, I'm gonna be a part of the uh, Maximum Football Simulation League post-game weekly show with the covers the weekly cover of the Simulation League so most of the Simulation League stuff that I'm gonna do is gonna be over there so if you're interested in the Simulation League or if you're here because of me or Maxim Football, you should really join there as it's a good thing. And the team is doing an amazing job. We are like 30 people over there. So yeah, you should really check that out and subscribe if you, if you haven't subscribed there or here to be honest because 95% of you are unsubscribed, which is insane. Like, god damn it. 95% of my watchers are unsubscribed. If you're not subscribed, again, I cannot control you. But please, I, I ask you to subscribe as I'm a small channel. And every sub helps. So if you want to help a smaller channel to, to get some success in this... Please subscribe and yeah, and leave a like, follow, like follow me on Twitter, and yeah, that's it. And now the last thing I want to talk about is how the simulation league is gonna go. As Spear the other day has talked about the fact that over 800 people are interested in the simulation league, which honestly is insane. Think about it over 800 it's the official simulation league so you know that's gonna be like bigger than any other simulation league but over 800 people but that got me starting to think is this enough is this a good amount of players let's not forget that they want to have athletic directors and coaches for each team. So even if they scrap the idea of an athletic director, that's 130 coaches. Right now what we want is to get the amount of numbers. And that is a big deal. Because let's say there are athletic directors and coaches that 260 people that that's it that's their job and then they're like what 600 players left that's four to five players for each team and let's say those user created are superstars like 10 overall above the rest what if there's an influx on a position like the quarterback what if there's over 130 quarterbacks in the simulation league what gonna happen are you gonna put a quarterback on the bench a user created quarterback on the bench when like there's no linebackers why would you take that why would you take that risk and that is another thing that we need to remember what's going to happen in like a couple of days in like the first season is a transfer portal gonna be insane is recruiting gonna be like too too big because the five-star recruits the top recruits are gonna all want to go to one team and then like you'll have a team that recruits way too many superstars and then becomes a powerhouse or what will happen Are, is somebody gonna 
go and switch a program around? What's going to happen? Nobody actually knows yet. And that makes you think, like, you know that there's an influx on quarterbacks. So are you going to put a cap on quarterbacks and, like, say, after the 130th guy tries to get to a quarterback and they're going to say to him, well, no, we got too many of them already. Or if you want, you can be a recruit and then, like, a senior quarterback leaves. Okay, here is a new quarterback. But what's going to happen? What's going to become the new thing? And again, there's four to five players on each team. If we're going to go with 130 U.S. college-based rules. 130 teams are a lot. And yeah, and like we still don't know what's going to happen. And we are really interested to see what's going to come. And... Here's the last thing, probably, that I'm going to talk about it. Uh, If you are going to go into the simulation league and you do want to be, like, covered already, uh, you can become one of the MGN sports big men on campus. Uh, That's how we call our big dogs, like the top players. They're the big men on campus. And if you do, uh, you can leave a comment here with the position you're going to play. And you can do it on MGN Sports, Twitter, and YouTube as well. Because we're going to be taking stuff from there as well. And yeah, that's basically it. Like, I know there's not a lot of things I've talked about, and I stretched it over to eight minutes, probably. But, yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video. If you did enjoy this video, please make sure to like and subscribe, because I do need uh, this. I don't really need this, but, like, I do want to make this a thing. And I really enjoy making these videos for you. And I know the last one failed completely. And that's okay. So if you're if you're feeling like it, watch my uh watch the video I did before this. As it failed completely. 21 views. And yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video. Like and subscribe if you feel like it. And we'll see you all next time. Peace.